Hi everyone, Fenris Models here, and today I want to take you on the walkthrough of how I painted up my F2A2 Brewster Buffalo in 148 scale from Tamiya. First, I start with pre-shading all of the panel lines. This is doubly important on this kit because I'm not planning on panel lining it, but I'll give more detail on that a bit later. The pre-shading is done in black, and I actually take care not to be too terribly clean with the lines. I want the sort of messiness with them that will add some nice visual interest in the kit when we apply the next coat. I then applied a layer of Vallejo Model Air USAF Light Gray, product code 71.296, on the underside of the plane, making sure to leave some of the pre-shading showing through. Which was then followed by a similar application of Vallejo Model Air Camouflage Medium Brown, 71.038, on the top half of the plane. You can see here that I again took care to leave some of the pre-shading showing through. Unfortunately, I had run out of gloss varnish and I knew that my panel liner would not behave nicely for me at that step, so I opted to let the pre-shading do all of the work here. I think it winds up turning out alright. Let me know what you think by the end of the video. Once I was satisfied with the coverage and the brown had dried, I used USAF Green, Model Air 71.124, to block out the camouflage pattern. I did this freehand, but I did have the scheme pulled up on my monitor to follow. In the end, it looks pretty good if I do say so myself. Next up are the touch-ups. These are things like painting the wheels, bombs, prop and spinner in black, the exhausts in gunmetal, and tending to any overspray. Then it was time to start the decals. I started by carefully trimming the decals from the sheet and separating them into their own pieces. Now again, because I didn't have any gloss varnish, I needed to rely heavily on microset to help reduce any silvering in the decals. I put a little down straight on the paint and then gently teased each decal into place. Due to the age of the kit, there were a few decals that had torn in places. That wasn't a big deal at all, I just simply applied the torn pieces where they should be and the damage all but disappeared. Once all the decals were applied, they got a coat of Microsol applied. Some needed more than one application to help give it a more of a painted on effect. And there you have it, the Tamiya F2A2 Brewster Buffalo in 148 scale. I quite enjoyed this build, but I do wish that I had some gloss varnish on hand. I think the effect would have been even better, but I'm quite happy with what I accomplished with what I had. So what do you think of this build? If you were able to get your hands on this kit, I would love to see how you get on with it. Make sure to like and subscribe and all that, and as always, thank you so very much for watching. It means the world to me that you would take your time out of your day for this. So please, stay safe, and remember, keep modeling.